hi guys welcome back to my channel today we are going to make another beader choker which can be used for events as a uh, weddings when you want to be a bridesmaid and this is how we are going to go about it we need a size of these pearls the same lockets we used the last time and then this is seed beads they are very very small and tiny and then this is a medium kind of pearl this is how it looks like and then this is a smaller size of this type this is a smaller size and then we are going to use the same fish line of 0 0.35 millimeters so let's get starting this is going to be a finished product of what we are going to do so just sit and then watch me do my thing okay so i take my locket i pass it through and then i locate it at the center okay so I fixed 16 of this so one I pass it through the two fish lines so we have 16 of this we are going to put on one here and then that's one here one here so one on the left then the same one on the right you push it down so after pushing it down you have something like this then you take two of the seed beads just two one two on the right then another two on the left so one two then you push it down again you have something like this you fix one of this on each side so i have one here And then one here then another two each one two then one two then you interlock with the large size so I put in the right then I put Cross it with the lips like that. Then I push it down. So you have something like this. I continue till I get something like this. have now we have extended it to this depending on the size of your neck my neck is very small so I chose to make the middle 13 so after making it 13 
I will still fix the two of the seed beads, one of this and then the two of the seed beads, just as I thought earlier. Then I fix one of this, that's the medium, one on the right, one of the left. To get something like this we are sealing it up then i pass through the two fish lines just as i did from the beginning i'm going to wear 16 of it so one two as i'm doing it i'll be getting something like this so i'm going to continue to the end 16 of it So after fixing the 16 of the medium pearls, I'm going to fix this. This is a tiny knob. Okay, that is used to do sealing. So I'll fix it. I'll put the fish line through the two. And then I'll add the locket. I'll pass it through it again like that. I push it down so just as it is here after fixing it this is the fish line you take the knob and then pass it through it downwards like that and that is going to help us push it down it makes it tighter and firm then you take your tool and then you you press the circular knot to make it tighter so like this so after pressing with the tool i decided to just tie three times because sometimes when you wear it, um, the knob here gets weaker. You can as well sometimes decide to use three, but I decided to use just one. So after tying it, you pass the knob through three of the pearls. So one, two, three. You can as well pass it through just the two, then we cut it. So that's what I'm going to do now. So it goes down, this is it. Then you cut it. So after having something like this, this is the fish line. I'm going to just cut it. That is it. So the line will just enter one of the pearls. Then we have a full V. So this is a beaded pearl necklace for an event, for weddings, for parties, etc. Okay, so getting started, I take my locket, and this is how it's supposed to be like. And then I cut my fish line of desire length, and then I pass it through like that. I center it in the middle. Then I fix three of my medium sized pearls. So I have something like this then 
I fix one on each line so one on my right and then one on my left I get something like this baby okay so after getting something like this I'm going to fix two of the seed beads so they are very tiny you can use any color of your choice so two on each line so I fix two of the seed beads on each line so one so one two and then another two on my right one two then I fix the smaller size one each so one here one here then I fix the smaller seed beads again so I'll, I'm going to fix two so one two Then one, two. Then I interlock with the large bead. I interlock. I push everything down. So I get something like this. To make it easier for you to understand, I'm just going to fix two seed beads like that and then one small like that and then I continue with the last seed bead so I fix this on one line and I repeat the same for the other line then I interlock with the large size so one two then the small size pearl one then two again of this one two then I interlock with a large pearl I get something like this so I'm going to repeat it till I get my desired length and get back to you okay guys so as you can see I've extended it a bit so I'm going to continue so you see the process properly So sealing it up, I'm going to fix the same process again, but this time I'm going to make it three. So one, two, three. Then I fix the medium, the very small size. Then I fix another three. One, two, three. And then I repeat same with the other side. Because I'm sealing it up, I'm just going to continue like I started here. So I take my medium size, one on each line, one here, one here. So we have something like this. So sealing it up, I'm going to pass two both lines like that. So in a nutshell, 
we are getting something like this okay so to fix the lockets um, I could have used the silver the very very tiny no but I'm doing it direct so I'll pass it through like that downwards and then as you can see these are three beads I'm going to pass my fish line downwards to one of the beads And then I'll tie it here and then pass it to these two and then I'll cut it. So I'll do it and get back to you shortly. Okay guys, so this brings us to the end of our tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment down below what you want us to do for you. Alright guys, as you can see, this is our beautifully made bracelet. You can wear it for events, parties, weddings, etc. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.